she used to come in here with her friends and uh, a whole bunch of them. For a quarter of a century, Dale Dinwiddie's missing flyer has hung on the wall in Andy's Deli in Columbia's Five Points. This is the original poster when, they, when she first, like the next day she was missing. Andy Schnan says the 23-year-old was a frequent customer before she disappeared from Five Points on September 24, 1992. She was a very nice car. Schnan owns the 40-year-old deli. Thank you very much. He remembers her fondly. She was beautiful, and everybody was sad uh, when she was missing. She had gone to the U2 concert at Williams Bryce Stadium that fall night. She lost touch with her friends and looked for them at Jungle Gyms, now the horseshoe in Five Points. She was last seen walking toward Hardin and Green Street. Dale Dinwiddie wasn't... Uh, the type of person that would run away or anything like that. Why has this case been so difficult to solve? I mean, the biggest problem is there's no real crime scene. There's, there's no body, so there's you know, no evidence. Mark Vinson of the Columbia Police Department has been the lead investigator on the case for the last 10 years. Despite more than a thousand tips, numerous searches and three confessions, the case remains unsolved. How frustrating has it been to hit so many dead ends? It, I mean, it's, it's very frustrating. You're hopeful. You, you know, you want to be able to provide some closure for the family. Uh, and the worst thing that can happen to any person is to have, you know, something happen to their child. Dale's parents and brother still live in the Columbia area. Maybe someone will remember something that could help us find Dale. But declined to be interviewed. In a statement to watch Fox News, they say, quote, we want to keep the focus on Dale and not our family. End quote. They urge anyone with any information to contact the Richland County Sheriff's Office or Columbia Police. With the help of all of you all and the public, we will do this. What would you say to the person who is responsible for the crime? Uh, I mean, I would hope that person would be you know, willing to come forward after all this time if, if, or at least provide some kind of information that might even lead us to where she is. Until that day comes, Dale's family and friends will continue to miss her, and her flyer will stay in Andy's deli. Why have you uh, still kept the poster up to the day? Hoping, same? hoping that one day she will be here, and uh, we will see her again. One of the main suspects in the case is Ronaldo Javier Rivera, known as Ray Rivera. He's a serial killer on death row in Georgia. Ray Rivera was living in Colombia when Dale disappeared and was interviewed by Columbia police. Right now, police say they don't have enough evidence to tie him to her disappearance, but he's still considered a suspect. The Columbia Police Department is still offering a $20,000 reward for anybody with information. In studio, Courtney King, Watch Fox News.